Assalamu alaikum friends, Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. First, we have to open a new file pot. In this video, we are going to create a swept flange in a sheet metal. Select a plane which you want to sketch and make it to the normal view. First, we have to create a base flange tab in a sheet metal. So, draw the basic sketch for a sheet metal. By using the lines, you have to draw the profile with the reference of rectangle. After drawing the required profile, we have to using a Dream Entities to delete the unwanted line segments and click OK, exit the sketch, go to the sheet metal tab and select a base flange tab with corresponding to our sketch and specify the amount of thickness for the sheet metal with the bending allowance as per your requirement and click OK. Now we have to draw the profile for a swept flange. So select a face where we want to sketch and draw the profile here make it to the normal view and draw the circle the circle must be tangent to the selected face so after drawing the circle you have to make it at corresponding position to edge of the sheet metal and click OK. Likewise, you have to apply the tangent relationship in between the selected edge and a circle. Make sure you have make a tangent relationship with the coincident of a edge of the sheet metal. After requirement these relations, we have to create a profile with the reference of the circle. Without giving the tangent relationship, it is not possible to create a susceptible in a sheet metal. So first we need to draw the circle like this and then you have to draw the profile with the circles. Then you can also utilize the line profile for creating a susceptible inch flange. Now I am utilizing the line and arc entities as a profile of susceptible inch flange. After drawing this profile, you have to make dim entities to delete the unwanted segments. Now I am just delete the off of the circle which we created previously and then click OK. Now we have a profile. The profile must be open and you can't draw the profile by using the splines. Then exit the sketch. Then we have go for tools, sorry insert. Inside the inset, we need to select a sheet metal. Here we have an option of swept blend flange. Select a swept flange. After selecting this, the dialog box is appearance here. We have to select a profile first, and then we have to select a path. The path is nothing but is the edge of the sheet metal. I am just select edge of the sheet metal, which is perpendicular to our profile. Now the septic blanch is creating successfully here. Then click OK. You can't able to select more edges here as a path. Now the septic blanch is successfully created. You have to apply the color for good appearance of septic blanch. To get the regular updates of my videos, please subscribe in my channel. Don't forget to like and share. Inshallah, we will meet in the next video. Thanks for watching.